helping this morning. Two Chicago area residents are among 103 people who survived a fiery plane crash in Mexico. One is a priest from the Shrine of Our Lady of Guadalupe in Des Plaines. And that's where CBS 2's Mike Puccinelli joins us now live with reaction. Mike, good morning. Hi, and he is Father Ezekiel um, her, Sanchez, rather, and according to the Archdiocese, he right now is in the hospital, alert and conscious, but is resting fairly comfortably considering what happened. Y entre ellos, como sabemos, iba nuestro rector, el Padre Ezequiel Sanchez. Now that's a Facebook message from a fellow priest at Our Lady of Guadalupe updating parishioners about their injured leader. Hundreds of people have been leaving well wishes on the site after learning that Father Sanchez was on that plane. The Chicago-born priest was returning from vacation in his family's ancestral hometown when the plane went down. Sanchez was one of 99 passengers who survived this fiery wreck in Durango, Mexico. It happened after the plane fell from the sky shortly after takeoff. Four crew members were also on board. They also survived, but the pilot is critically injured. Joliet resident Annabelle Estrada was on board and talked about how the plane hit the ground a first time before crashing after striking it a second time. Father Manuel Padilla serves with Father Sanchez and spoke with his injured colleague after that crash. He collapsed, telling us that he was in the plane, he had the accident. And he has, from the hospital collapse, and he has a broken heart, and some contusion, some pain, and thanks to God, nobody dies. Mexican officials are still trying to determine exactly what caused the crash, but strong winds are suspected. Now, a team of technicians from Ember, the planes manufacturer from Brazil, they're on their way right now to that site to try and see exactly what happened technologically. Reporting live in Des Plaines, Mike Puccinelli, CBS 2 News. Suzanne? Thanks so much, Mike.